episode of CCW Alive Wrestling. Dan Evans here with the genius Lady Papo. Lady, we got a great card tonight, and I'm excited about the main event. I agree 100%. It's going to be super crazy against the King of Flight, Will Austin. It's going to be a great one. Our first match is already, already in progress. Let's go to the ring. I don't hear you cheering anymore. What Stefan Rivera taking on the magnificent Johnny Walker. The genius will be joining me hopefully for the main event. He had a scheduled Zoom call that he had to take. There he goes, Stefan Rivera out of the way, firing away back on Johnny Walker. Right and left boots to the legs. He has him really. Johnny Walker slumped in the corner. Rivera now going after him. Oh, Johnny Walker out of the way, and Rivera finds him in a pla himself in a place that no man wants to be. Rivera in trouble. Walker aggressive as always, and an elbow to the base of the skull. Walker, ever the politician, somehow has convinced General Manager Tom Nash to grant him a match with Cha Cha Charlie next week here on CCW Live Wrestling. And if he wins, he will get the number one contendership from Cha Cha that he earned by defeating Vince Steele at Summer Glory. Walker firmly in control now. And up oh, there you go, showing himself. The fans just don't like it. And the pat did Johnny Walker leg drop. Could be covering and go for the victory, but he does not. Walking away from Stefan Rivera could be a mistake on the part of Johnny Walker. Rivera is no slouch. He lacks experience, but he has a bright future here in CCW. Up on the shoulders, though. If he hits this, it's over. The Johnny drop. Let's see if he can nail it. And he does. Flat down goes Stefan Rivera. One, two, three. And your winner. Johnny Walker. The crowd is not happy about it. Wrestling fans, CCW will return to Nashville, Tennessee on October 24th. Let's take a look. Wrestling fans, Coastal Championship Wrestling returns to the Music City on October 24th. Live for Halloween Hardcore Heaven at Helio Stratton in Nashville, Tennessee. Your huge main event is Sabu versus the neck break kid Alex Ocean. Go to Coastal Championship Wrestling FL.com and buy your tickets today. They're going fast. fans and it's time for the CCW Rookie Challenge. Noah King taking on Zero Gravity. Both of these young men are graduates of the CCW training facility right here in South Florida. If you think you have what it takes to enter the squared circle, call 954-397-6421 and find out how you can make an impact on the pro wrestling scene. Just like these two men, scoop of the leg by Zero Gravity, kick out now by Noah King. Zero Gravity is going to have to be a little bit more aggressive with King. He does have a size advantage over Zero Gravity. And Zero Gravity now shoving King back into the corner. King coming out with a clothesline, but Zero Gravity with a bridge duck under it and a flying head scissors and a kip up. This young man is so quick. 
He is so agile. And a forearm to the head. He's the aggressor now. But a nice reversal by Noah King, and he wipes him out with a clothesline. King now with a boot to the head. Setting him up, going for the vertical suplex, it looks like. And nicely executed down goes zero gravity. The crowd likes what they're seeing. Wait a minute. Bill Alfonso now out at ringside. That doggone whistle blaring through the building. Venetius, his Brazilian destroyer, stepping into the ring. He has no business. This is going to be a disqualification, obviously, or a no contest. Zero gravity. And Noah King going after him. Good for you guys. Don't let him take your spotlight. This is your moment. Oh, no. Venetius with an elbow to Noah King's chest. And down he goes. Zero gravity coming off the second rope with some momentum. But Venetius catches him. Good God. Greetings from Copacabana. You could just peel him off the mat. And that's what Venetius is going to do. The Brazilian destroyer. This side has been the same size since he was 12 years old. Oh, my goodness. It could be a serious injury to zero gravity as he went flying over the top rope at the hands of Venetius. Noah King now going after the forearms to the side of the head, having very little effect on the giant Brazilian destroyer Venetius. As I was saying before, Bill Alfonso finding Venetius in Sao Paulo, Brazil at the age of 12 years old, beating up grown men in bare knuckle fighting matches. And he, at his first opportunity, brought him over here to the United States to be, and grooming him to be the next CCW World Heavyweight Champion. Venetius is just relentless and vicious and uncaring about the welfare of his opponents. And as you see here, now if he nails that claw hook. You know why they call him the giant? Because he's that big when he was 12 years old. I've seen him take an apple and just crush it and pulverize it. He has a claw slam there, picking Noah King up off the ground and driving him into the mat. Bill Alfonso needs to get him off there. The referees need to physically remove him before some permanent damage is done to Noah King. Get that man off of Bill Alfonso, do your job. He just loves what he sees. He loves when Venetius inflicts punishment. Finally relented. We have some officials coming from the back. Zero gravity still on the outside. The fans don't like what they see here. bring them all out. Two times. Well, Tim, right there, Daddy. Look at Santos. He's badass. CCW heavyweight champion checking on zero gravity. These kids at the CCW training facility really looked up the hell. Jefe Santos, he has been advising them and guiding them. We'll see if we can get some order restored here, and we'll take a quick timeout and hear a word from our sponsor. We'll be back right after this. Super Crazy is back here in CCW, taking on the King of Light, Will Austin, next in our main event on CCW Alive Wrestling. Wrestling fans, Coastal Championship Wrestling returns to the Music City on October 24th, live for Halloween Hardcore Heaven at Helio Granite in Nashville, Tennessee. Your huge main event is Sabu versus the Neck Break Kid Alex Ocean. Go to Coastal Championship Wrestling FL.com and buy your tickets today. They're going fast. Super Crazy has been teaming up with the great Pablo Marquez of late. They've been in tournaments all over the world. These are world traveling superstars, Pablo Marquez and Super Crazy, and they are quite the tag team. I'd like to see what he has to do in singles action right now against the King of Flight, Will Austin. Crazy getting the fans into it. Chris Austin is a cocky kid. He's got a high opinion of himself for sure. We'll see if he can stand his own against a veteran like Super Crazy. I just hope nobody tries to interfere in this match because the talent that's here deserves to be seen. You know, you're 100% right. You gotta be careful because as I said, Super Crazy teaming a lot with Pablo Marquez. Will Lawson known to be aligned with the magnificent Johnny Walker who we saw earlier tonight and is a dangerous individual in his own right. Super Crazy now in control with a side headlock, kicking it out to an arm ringer. 
and ringing the arm again. And switching off and over goes Will Austin. Dan, I have to admit, you know your moves because that's all happening very quickly and you are calling it perfectly in real time. Thank you, sir. That is a huge compliment coming from you. You are the genius. I'm smarter than the Evers Bear. <laughs> Absolutely. And a kick to the leg by Super Crazy. Across the ring, Will Austin up and over, man, twisting it into a hip up front headset, front somersault. Excuse me, my tongue's got tied. He's so fat. And now, Super Crazy, a nice reversal. This one's going to be tough to call. The two are so quick. Too smart, but he's waiting right behind you. Nice wing lock takeover as a counter by Super Crazy. Austin goes down under a clothesline, under an elbow. Oh, what a flying Hurricane Rana. What a tremendous move by Will Austin. Super crazy. Going for some air, taking a breather now. Austin is dangerous as he comes over the top rope. Onto the apron. Whoa, super crazy out of the way. And a kick to the gut. These two outside of the ring, a nice chop there by super crazy. Back to the ring and onto the apron. A kick right to the kisser of Super Crazy Will Lawson now in control. Both men on the outside of the ring. Referee Juan Lucinella counting them out now. That will break the count. Super Crazy back into the ring. Austin now taking his time. He, want, he might want to get a move on, but again, Manny, this man is cocky and arrogant. He's not in quite a hurry to do anything. Wow, nicely done. Caught his feet on the ropes, using it for momentum and flipping over onto his opponent. Super crazy catch. There you go, Juan Lucinella. Super crazy with his foot on the rope. He is the king of flight, Will Austin. Yeah, he really has earned that moniker, without a doubt. KG kicking the rope. He's taking advantage of every part of the ring. This man has been in this business for a couple of years now, and he works more like a five or six year veteran. Referee checking on Super Crazy. He is going to continue now, setting him up for a belly to back. Suplex and he nails it. Super Crazy in trouble now. Will Austin taking advantage. Cover that man. Two. Crazy is out of there. Austin now looks to be going to work on the arm. Some knees to the gut. And here he goes, climbing the ropes. What incredible agility. Oh my goodness gracious. Oh, super crazy out of there. See, now he took too many chances, Lanny, and the veteran, super crazy, took advantage of that. I believe that uh, the, the king of flight is nauseated. <laughs> that would be the least of his problems. But again, maybe playing a little bit of possum. As he's ch choking now, super crazy on the second rope, and the referee right in his face, counting him out. Breaking him before the count of five, avoiding a disqualification. Will Austin now back on super crazy. Surprised he's recovered so easily from that uh, horrible incident with the top rope. Tilt to world, backbreaker, a patented move by super crazy. Big back body drop goes Will Austin over. And a flying drop kick, driving Austin right in the jaw. Super crazy to control. He's fired up, and he is ready for more action. And here he comes. Get on that man, super crazy. Now's the time to take advantage of it and try and put an end to Will Austin. A haphazard, lackadaisical reversal now by Will Austin. Not sure that he got all he wanted out of that move. As I thought, super crazy, not hurt too badly and easily out of the way. What is he setting up for here? It looks like the tarantula, and it is, but that is an illegal move as he's tied into the ropes. Referee Ron Lucinella counting now. He's got it in tight. He's just got to break it before five to avoid the disqualification, and he does. Austin now in the center of the ring. Super crazy, fired up on the outside. The fans chanting his name. Super crazy kind of looks like a tarantula if you. Get a good look at his face. 
know what? You're not too far off on that one, Lane. Nice roundhouse kick by Will Austin. Well, this kid is super tough, and that's without a doubt. He's putting him in his position for it. Uh, it looks like a top rope maneuver now going up to the second rope. What does he have in mind? He's checking the ceiling height here and making sure he has enough room to do what he wants to do. But again, the king of flight loves to fly. Super crazy out of the way. King of flight down on both knees. That will ground him. If he keeps doing that on his knees, he's not going to be the king of flight very long. You're 100% right about that. Move solid, but Austin out of the way. Nice sabat kick right to the chin. Not enough to take him off his feet. Hooking him for a suplex. And he does get him over. Referee out of position. Two, three. Wow, kind of surprised at that. The winner of the match, Will Austin. A surprising end. A vertical suplex took Super Crazy out. He might be hurt from a previous move. Very surprising finish to this match. I just hope the King of Flight doesn't get a big ego over this victory. Well, that was your main event for the inaugural episode of CCW Alive Wrestling. And we'll be back next week. I'm smarter than the average bear.